Why must it be Rosie? Because she was fornicating with a fella. So you're back, are you? What is this? What do you want? Not you. Well, then get out. Go on, get out. Shut up, Shaughnessy. You. You've been tried and found guilty. You're the informer. What? Busted at the seams with innocence. Joe, for God's sake, don't do it. You don't do it. If she was a man, Mr. Ryan, she'd be shot. What is this? Listen, numbskull. Someone that morning went up to the camp and betrayed Tim O'Leary. Now, who lives near enough? Who had time enough? Who would? Who did? That bitch you call your wife. But anyone could have if anyone did. The whole village was abroad. No, the village was down on the beach. Except you. You came late. We came together. We spoke to no one. You'd say that, of course. Young Cathy was with us. <laughs> Young Cathy would say black was white if you told her. But then anyone, anyone at all could have gone into the police station and used the telephone. That's where you're wrong. They couldn't. Could they, Tom? No. And why not? Because Tom went in there himself and cut the wire. Didn't you, Tom? Well, you went in there yourself, didn't you? Yes. And you cut the wire, didn't you? Well, what do you say now? Nothing. Take her out. No, 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 no. you're taking her nowhere. Stop him! <laughs>
Look here, Father Hugh. The stripping of her was an accident. Oh. Steady, Joe. You're taking advantage of your cloth, Father Hugh. That's what it's for. Come on, Joe. It's not right. The priest is only a man. 